And last but definitely not least, our Pro-Am winners, the number 88 AF quarter, Orica Gibson, the first win and the third, third different winner this year. So congratulations, guys. Francois Perodo, Nicholas Nielsen, Alessio Rivera. Francois, you started. Um, safety cars, four course yellows. What was going on out there? It was a really tough race for me. Um, I mean, my number one enemy is the heat. So really, really hard race today. And uh, on top of that, Friday, we had, uh, we had a fire in the car. So we didn't run at all. So we only had FP2 and, uh, and then straight into quali. Alessio did a good job, uh, placed it P5. I had a tough, uh, tough start. I, I was trying to keep up with Sally in car 34, but you know, he was just flying today. So not, uh, not a great double stint for me, especially with the heat. But then uh, I think I managed to uh, hand back the car I think P3 or P4 in class to Niklas, and uh, he was absolutely flying. And then uh, Alessio brought it home in, uh, in P1. So, you know, thrilled with this victory. Really, really happy. We have to talk about tyres. Tire degradation is always something going on with this. Yeah, it's still there. Tire degradation is always something. Got to talk about this kit. What was it like out there? Tires and traffic. Uh, so, I mean, yeah, we have to look after the front left corner particularly, so we're talking uh, T3 and T9, which are very hard on the tires, but uh, yeah, it was okay, you know, try to, try to keep it, uh, you know, not too aggressive in the first stint and, uh, and finish the second stint, you know, not too far in terms of performance. Nicholas, you took over the car, you were up to sixth, I think, by that point, overall, I'm talking about, in the lead of the Pro-Am class, so he gave you a good car to work with. Yeah, like Francois said, the, the car was definitely um, uh, performing very well today. So the, the guys has, has been doing a great job also coming back from, from the issue we had um, in free practice. So, uh, I mean, it was all about being a bit conservative in the beginning on the tires, not to, uh, to let's say, overheat or destroy the front, the front left before, um, before coming into, um, let's say, the real part of the race. But... Uh, I think the car was really good, and it was, uh, I wouldn't say easy to drive, but it was easy to manage, and, uh, and um, yeah, the performance today was, um, was definitely the best we've had so far this season. That's great. Well, let's see, you took the car over, you were having a great battle with Richard Bagley, I think, at one point. Uh, there was a bit of contact, was everything okay? Yeah, it was a um, fair, fair play uh, from the driver. Uh, uh, just I tried to manage the, the gap that Niklas created. He did an amazing job. Uh, the car was just flying, uh, so as I said, uh, I had to, to bring the car home and uh, achieve the victory. Uh, we were so close uh, two times in Monza and in Imola, and finally we, we achieved this uh, fantastic uh, victory. Uh, now we, we look to Spa, uh, another great circuit. Uh, for sure we will uh, be uh, fast also there.